In today's video, we are checking out the Life or Death Lucky Draw with the Nova Gold Legendary uh, uh, Kilo One Four One. So let's get into the. Uh, make sure to like and subscribe, and let's get into the video. Okay, so today's video goes to Sharkman, and uh, the, uh, formerly known as Scully on this channel. Uh, obviously, I'll be on the screen and down below in the description. But uh, basically, they've been subscribed to me for a long time. They are trying to reach 50 subscribers, so if we can help them get that, that would be much appreciated. Uh, but yeah. Um, hopefully that they should be uploading more content soon. Hopefully, um, but yeah, make sure to go uh, like, like the videos, watch the videos, and subscribe to them. And let's get into the gameplay. Okay, very nice, very nice. Okay, so here we are in the draw. I've got enough money to do one draw, so let's get over and done with. Please be something good. <sighs> Another backpack. I've probably never used a nice backpack. Well, I don't. I just, I just don't use backpacks that often. So let's go for the RPD first. Um, yeah, it's a nice RPD skin to be fair. A nice. Uh, if you have the legendary one, it's, it's a very nice one. I like like the yellow, yellow animated bits. Oh uh, yeah, decent, decent is the is the gold RPD gold elixir. This is, I'm guessing this is very nice. Not one of my favorite, one of the nicer um, um, emotes in the in like in the lucky draws. Uh, I would give it a seven out of ten. Um, then we have the axe. Oh, so the decent axe skin. I've got a best axe skins because that, that handle is kind of bland. But I do. If it was more like the yellow animated bit all the way across, I'd be a lot better. But about this about a six out of ten at the moment. Then we have. I guess. I guess I'll quickly show you the uh, avatar. Here is the calling card. And no one really cares about them. This is the tank skin. Very nice tank skin, I would say. Um, if maybe a bit more of the animated yellow bit over it, but other than that, uh, no real tweaks. Probably about a seven out of ten. Uh, then we have the character skin. Ah, that's actually a nice character skin. If you like more of the um, dark, a darker vibe character skins, obviously I like the more colourful ones. But if 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 then now this will be your vibe. Um, but yeah, so it's a decent. I'd say it's a decent character skin. It's about an eight, eight or seven out of ten again. And next we have the Kilo One Four One. This is a, in um, th th third person mode. I like the mag. The mag is very nice, and I, heard, I believe the eyesight is really good on this one as well. So it's probably a good idea to pick this one up if you don't have the mythic. That is, other than, other than like the actual like pipes and stuff though, it is kind of a boring mythic. Here is the. It's in third person. Here's the iron sights, as you can see, very, very nice iron sights right there. Here's it when you're running, and here is the weapon inspect. Yeah, it's about a 6 out of 10 legendary, I'd say. Not the best, but not the worst either. Okay, let's get into the gameplay, or the training match, probably, actually. Okay, so here we are in the training mode. Um, as you can see, this is I've got, I have the mythic kilo. Okay, so let's see, let's look at the kilo damage numbers. 40 to that, which means it's a 3, what was this uh, lower body? 29. Which means it's probably a, um, you have to get two headshots for it to 3 tap. Let's just go all the way back to the longest range, shall we? Let's see what our damage numbers it puts out. Twenty-three to the body. I don't know if I'm about to get a headshot or not. Thirty-two to the head. So you have to. You can't even get. If you get three headshots, you can't get a, two, a three shot kill. Okay. Well, not 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 actually. To be fair, not quite as good as the. Um, not quite as good as the. Um, as the GKS. So uh, yeah, now, now let's get into the uh, gameplay.
GG's and GG's Jeez. Okay, so here is my Kilo one for one loadout. We have the Monolith Expressor for the plus 25 damage at range and the science ability. We have the OWC Marksman Barrel for the minus 7.8% ADS bullet spread, plus 35% damage at range, minus 6% ADS horizontal recoil, even, and minus 14.7% vertical recoil. We have the no stop for the minus 14% ADS time, plus 3.3% movement speed, and Plus 20% ADS movement speed. We have the OWC TAC laser for the minus 8% ADS time, minus 9.2% ADS bullet spread. And finally, we have the extended mag, large extended mag B for the plus 20 mag capacity.